Officials dismissed classes at a Sandy Springs private school today after police feared a coach would bring a gun to the school. Now, police say the man left Holy Innocence Episcopal School and then bought a weapon. Police now say he wasn't planning to harm anybody at the school. Fox 5's Jacqueline Schultz tells us why the man faces charges after his confrontation with officers. To hear what happened is shocking, disturbing, mind boggling. Parents in a panic as they picked up their kids from school after teachers locked it down. Holy Innocence Episcopal School officials say they feared a coach would be a threat after they placed him on leave. Police say administrators confronted a coach Wednesday morning over possible inappropriate texts and emails to former students, then had a private investigator follow him as he went to buy a gun. Person followed the teacher to uh, a Bass Pro Shop where he purchased a handgun. Police could not say why the school hired an investigator, but say that investigator called police concerned what the coach could do. Police say they pulled over the coach at the corner of Roswell Road and Abernathy, and he resisted arrest. When our employees made contact with the subject uh, during the traffic stop, they uh, reported that he was loading the, the firearm. The coach taken into custody and arrested on charges of reckless conduct and obstruction. They tell us they took him to a local hospital. Late Wednesday, police say he did not intend to harm anyone at the school and his emails had no illegal content. One parent tells me he's sad over the ordeal surrounding a beloved coach. He is respected. He is revered. He's been an, uh, uh, an incredible coach. In Sandy Springs, Jacqueline Schultz, Fox 5 News.